Hi guys, karibuni sana to yet another episode of Miss New Idea Farm. If you are new here, karibu sana. If you are not new, thank you so so much for keeping with Miss New Idea Farm. Thank you so so much for 105 subs. Me to na grow. This is so exciting, honestly. Um please be sure to subscribe, to share, to like, to comment. Um and this is just a disclaimer that I am not a skincare professional. This is something that has worked for me. So before you start on this routine or do you embark on this journey, I feel like it's important for you to do research and adequate research. This is just like a guide towards the right direction, just in case you need it. Um, but like, be sure about the products. Do your research and decide for yourself, yeah? Um... I'd like to do a chit chat as I prepare the ingredients. Or oh, in case you're wondering why this baby is in a robe, it's because I am from the Frog's Kingdom. Yes, I said Frog's Kingdom. <laughs> and in case you're wondering why my why my skin is dry, kidogo dry, it's because um I've not moisturized yet. Like I've not embarked on the routine. I've not started the routine. So first, I will mask. Then I shall cleanse and then I will moisturize and tone. Um, those are the three basics I usually cleansing, moisturizing and uh, toning. Those are the things that you need for a sure routine, a, an effective routine. Sorry, I'm a bit distracted. I've just seen something outside. So yeah, guys, um, but I've incorporated a few other things like sunscreen and vitamin E because of my dark spots, yeah. So, so far so good. I'll give you a brief history and brief, brief background. journey of my acne and then I give you my routine and explain the benefits of some of these products I'm using. And please note that they are not endorsed yet. I'm not endorsing them yet. That yet is usually very important because I am speaking blessings upon my content. So yeah guys, um, so let's begin with the masking as I do a chit chat. Okay. So for a start, I'll give you, um, it's like a did you know segment but for skin. Um, the first one, I, re I hope that everyone knows this. I think everyone knows this one but just a friendly reminder that the skin is the largest organ in the human body and it constitutes 15 percent of your body so if you're 85 kgs 15 percent yeah 85 it's like 12 12 point 12 point something kilos of your body is skin so i feel like it's really important to take care of your skin Ah, I should be doing it as I prepare my mask. Wow. So it's in powder form. This is bentonite clay. The benefits if you see me referring constantly to um the, this book, it's because I took notes. Yes, I just needed to be sure, you know. Um so bentonite clay treats acne. When you mix it with rose water, rose water is my toner. I'll I'll photograph all this, so don't worry about don't strain too much. So I mix it because I mix it with this because it treats acne. Masking is important because it controls excessive uh, oil secretion. So see, some of you who've been in this struggle for a while know that one of the major causes of acne is because your sebaceous glands produce hella sebum. So this mask, this bentonite clay, okay, mix na your toner which is rose water, controls the excessive oil secretion. So it treats and prevents acne. Um, please don't use metal. With bento. Don't use a metal spoon to scoop this because apparently it becomes less effective when mixed with metal. Some sites say that it's a lie. Some say it's true, but I'm not taking chances. So you can use a plastic spoon. Or even a wooden spoon, but not metal. So I'm just going to get kidogo of that bentonite clay. Put it in a plastic cup. And then I'll mix it. So I wanted to give you guys a brief background about my acne journey. 
Oh yeah, two, three, okay. So I think, I feel like this journey began when I was like 14, 13. I had bouts of acne when I was in high school. Like it was really bad. Um, so it never used to bother me till I was like 16 and in form 3. And now you become more conscious of the fact that your skin is breaking out. So the first uh, ever treatment I used was, I'm not going to mention that product, but there's this mama who writes for Nation, I'm also not going to mention her. She's a skincare expert and she recommended this product. And I'm not going to shed it because it worked. By the way, I had such smooth skin in Form 3 and but now the problem with that product is it had uh, a bleaching effect. I was hella light. Like, as in you notice too, that icky too is bleaching you. And it's, nobody has that time, imagine. So I stopped using it. Then um, someone else recommended lanolin cream. <sighs> I should, shouldn't have mentioned it. But maybe it works for you, imagine. But... For me, it didn't really put a breakout. Like, it's like all the acne that had disappeared when I was using that other product that had a bleaching effect came back to haunt me. Because I got a breakout and then it really itched. So imagine when I break out, when I was in contact with the sun, it was such a bad time. I, I remember that. So when I went home for the holidays, um, I had the necessary conversation with my parents. Um... They were super supportive, thank God. So that marked the beginning of my medical acne treatment. Yeah. So this was like in form form three towards the end to form four. Um I started using a lotion I was given by my dog. I don't remember the name of that lotion, but I feel like it really it was my turn around acne wise because it didn't have a bleaching effect thank god um, my skin was, was restored back to its normal color and the acne reduced a great deal like even when it was that time, that time of the month like i wouldn't um where was i whispering my lord um like i wouldn't get mad breakouts so i feel like that 17 was my like turn around that was in form four so like i started seeing my skin improve so when i got to campo, hey, campus uh, my first ever friend in campus i don't know if she watches my content uh we lost touch like everyone else loses touch in campus but they what to lose touch after school i don't know why um so she introduces me to makeup i I'm not going to like, because even her, she had acne. So, like, our struggles are very similar. We talk about how we've tried uh, meds, we've tried products that have backfired. Um, and then she told me how she feels like makeup for now that stage in our life. We do it. Then I saw her start using it, and it was really working for her. But you know the problem with makeup? It doesn't deal with your base. It covers up. Because, um... In campus, Tosan, you can more aware of the acne scarring that had been caused by by popping pimples from Zamani. And like, I didn't have bad acne in campus, thank the Lord. Because now that med medicine will cure. I used that med, that lotion for a long time. Like a long period, I used to go back and buy it. So I'm like under insurance. I can't do it <laughs> adulting Ad adulting is so hard I remember the first time after graduation I went to the school I wanted to buy cough syrup I had a bad cold I had a tonsillitis pharyngitis yes a very bad coma so I went to the hospital and I was like this is a side story I was like hey si mini kubado anda kava ya mzazi nikambiwa ni produce my student id i'm like okay 
why apparently the state considers you an adult after graduation i was 21 i was 21 in get up unemployed youth at 21 so at least my parents paid cash for the fill up nice antibiotics sayoki for makibaya and but then like i enjoyed the cover fully because i used to go get that lotion a lot so yeah like i feel like now you know a bit of my struggle with acne it's still a bit cakey and as you guys can see i go cakey but i need to keep doing the needful and rose water yeah so my friend and i started using makeup but now as i've said makeup just covers it doesn't treat your base so yeah i can relax to my makeup for a while and then i quit makeup i started scrubbing scrubbing apparently is really harsh for your skin so don't scrub and you want to me apricot apricot scrub yes by scent eyes use louise babe can't you just keep these brands undercover yeah so the scrub you can do it's a bit harsh so i stopped um so from campus till date i feel like i've had a smooth run with acne because breakouts has jokwa massive it's just your kawaida hormonal breakout which honestly there's literally nothing you can do about it but please don't pop because as a one cycle this came up nigga pop look where it's got me another cycle this came up and then all this me from all the acne scarring this is not a new it's not acne it's a totally different thing um but yeah like you guys can see those dark spots so i was like you know what uh, I can't keep using makeup because pure makeup is a whole other mess. Like, you can just start breaking out. So, when I malizard my foundation, I was like, instead of getting more foundation, why not um, become why not become more focused and more serious about treating my skin and these dark spots because um, wow, hello, I cook cake sana the last one i made um so yeah guys that's it because mom let me start a routine so i consulted my sister because i have seen it i've seen this routine work for her and then she's progressed to introduce other um serums in her routine which i don't have now because i see i'm treating my base like me meanza yeah i may progress a bit and Serums are a bit expensive, so it will require time pia to save for me. But like these are very key for star for starters. You don't need to go harm on the product. So yeah, guys. Um, and please note that what might work for me might never work for you. Uh, it, this was a gamble because I know for sure. By si by the way, my sister has been very instrumental in my journey name shout out Apa. because she she'd been through this so she made it really easy for me even to get confidence you know because acne can really mess up your confidence you can start feeling like you're not it you know kwanza during that adolescent stage where your esteem is uh, your esteem is what is fragile yeah but now she made it really easy for me i had confidence issues but like they never got out of control you know really bounce back always so yeah disclaimer that what works for me might not work for you so please please do your research sis you might be allergic to something that is in this product ah yeah so that is when i decided to embark on this journey and i bought this product so far, so good. Three weeks down the line, see no complaints. But I just need to know and be a disclaimer that keep product away from your eyes. <laughs> Do not touch your eyes or this eye area with product. Uta utkita umana. Especially, I'm going to be doing um, 
I'll tell you when I get to that step, but like sunscreen na cleanser. Nisi karibio so ya kota fadhali. Just whatever, at all costs, even the instructions. By the way, I never used to read the instructions until I asked my sister, does product get in your eye? And she's like, sis, ata kwa nini wamesema, kwa container wamesema that you should keep it away from your eyes because, because it's dangerous. Oi, mi nini nani, mi usama instructions read instructions so many wale wa kama mbaya mbaya which is such a bad attitude sometimes because the first one week I was in the ghetto I kept touching I kept tearing up being irritated my eyes were irritated because that was just cleansing una cleanse kila mahali so product in acho kwa macho so you tear up you're in the office you're just out there tearing up aimlessly hi so I have, tomorrow I'm going back to work. There's things I need to do. So for the 15 minutes, I will wait for, the mask has to sit, the mask has to sit for 15 minutes. So in those 15 minutes, nita fanya a bit of catch up. Ya job, nikikisho pia nende. It's good to prepare, prep, because... Usiende ukiwa off guard. So ya, tumemaliza ni yitu. Our mask, I need to wash this off. I should take a photo of this. Chaniweke yote. Lazima. My most affected area, by the way, are usually areas, rather. Usually my right and left cheek. Some na unanga ina kuanga kwa forehead. Wengine kwa chin. But mimi, my huge, hugest, most affected region ni mekua my left and right cheek cheeks forehead did I ever used to get acne kwa forehead I think so that period adolescent period but like imagine don't worry if you are starting out if you are whatever in your journey wherever place you are kwa hii journey ya acne imagine to be encouraged that you can actually get better I've seen my sister's skin and like, I was like, okay, she moved real quick from acne to no acne, really quick. And go, uh, and by the way, she dispute makeup. I feel like makeup is also a very good art. If you'd like to invest in it also, why not? If you can invest in skincare routine, na makeup, why not? Me drew. Nili realize si pendi sana, it's too much work. I say that out loud. Yeah, it's those layers, those... Siju pakini, pakini. So I decided, let me just work on something I really like, which is this. I don't mind this. But I like makeup for lips, for eyes. Iyo na penda. With that one, I can't deny. But like the whole face bit. Girl, nobody got time for that. So, see you in 15. I start working. Guys, 16 minutes. Day two. Day three. Day four. A few moments later. One eternity later.
So hi guys, I'm back. Um, 15 minutes are over and it's tight. So yeah, and there's parts that are very irritating, they're itchy. So that's just a disclaimer when you start this journey. So yeah, let me go wash off, wash it off. And in case you're wondering why I'm shooting this in my room, it's because I tried shooting in the bathroom, but the echo, my word, the sound was really bad and I corner steamers they can just go wash come back then yeah <sighs> Ooh, so i'm back from rinsing off all that product here yeah, mask um this is just a disclaimer i don't know if i mentioned this bit but i do masking twice a week on wednesdays and on sundays today is sunday but i really hope you guys went to your online you guys attended your online services today's someone for us was overcoming fear the sun, the sun is out here overcoming fear so yeah guys don't mask every day i should have um written that for, or said that nikki nikki mask so the next product is oh, wow trust nkaka to use it first before showing you guys is this cleanser by Garnier but it's not apparently it's not Garnier it's Garnier skin active pure active three in one um I know that there's been hella bad reviews about Garnier products <sighs> I don't know why people say they're not okay even yeah because there are hella fake ones in the market this one but naivas and beauty bar kenya stock legit Garnier products okay naivas for sure so cookie get kwa naivas because in april later in a quarantine i won't say where the, the shop is but it's in one mall one big mall in westlands we went to that achilles you know jojo and i talk as I think it's quite affected. Mm -hmm. So we bought a Garnier product. <laughs> My sister and I had mad breakouts. Wow. Then when we checked to their website, it was not listed. And this is a shop in a big mall. So you'd think that, ah, wako na vitu legit. Ha, shock on us. The breakout. I told you that my forehead has never been affected. But like in April, Kiliumana, <laughs> Kiliumana properly. So yeah, be sure to get legit ones. But like I've not had a problem with this one. The reason why I got this one is because Beauty Bar had not stocked the cleanser I wanted. I wanted Al, Alpiga photo and then put it somewhere. I wanted the one by V. Oh, it's a lot harder when you're doing it from your room. It's easier to keep on a magic because you keep because it's now harsh. But still, no, 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 cleanse. I'll go finish the bathroom. Yeah, I wanted one by CeraVe. So the importance of cleansing, I use this one because it has sali, salicylic acid, which is helpful in preventing acne. Yeah, this is because it reduces secretion ya sebum na as i said sebaceous glands za watu wako na oily skin they usually very overproductive na sebum ziko sebum causes acne you know overproduction of sebum causes acne so this cleanser has that acid so that's why i went for it to reduce excessive secretion of sebum so in a prevent acne in a peer in a clean nikama this is like now my soup this is a soup for acne pits uh, i'll be back in a few after i've rinsed my face this back and forth wow exercise Turn up. i'm back so yeah i've just rinsed off the cleanser um let's get fresh usually what i do this is usually my first step when I shower. I do it in the shower. In YouTube, I video. But like, 
masking also comes way later in the evening i've just done it now because yeah i might as well show you guys the whole routine nisikuje kufilm later because you all know later never fikas so yeah that's why if you have any questions about the procedure of my routine i hope ni clear that up um yeah so after cleansing next it will you remember i told you the three masks cleanse tone and moisturize hmm? so rose water i use rose water uh, my toner all these products and the link down below na prices mtenda ku check ndio mjipange mm, toner usually evens out your skin complexion i am so grateful that sinanga hyper pigmentation you know some peeps usually on one side on kuanga darker than another side like your uneven skin tone so this one helps in evening out your skin tone <laughs> yeah um then um e research yote nilifanya to just school you guys and also to school myself cuz nilikuwa nimeanza routine and you see now that deep knowledge things like salicylic acid i, I just used to know that a lot of people with acne love products with that acid but like today ni mejua that it helps to control excessive secretion of sebum in the skin so yeah i feel really woke um so back to the toner guys um, it closes your pores you know so so kukona open pores in a give way to a lot of impurities to your skin yeah so this one it reduce it close closes up your pores and tap entire capture and string um so therefore it reduces and it prevents penetration of impurities from the environment sinajua there's a, usually a lot of impurities so what i usually do with this i spray it some people prefer to put it in cotton wool and then you dab it on your face girl ain't nobody got time if i can and usually by the way i didn't tell you guys i don't use a towel to wipe my face hmm? i just let it dry i saw this hack kwa gi confession i don't know if you guys follow her or watch her content i'm not that consistent but i i just like her and she's good way she's so loaded she was talking about how you know how the towel your towel usually has hella residue so she doesn't use um towels because even if you say enter to me a separate towel for my face see but do you use it for a period of time so that residue but either way it will still catch up so what i usually do i let my face dry up fast after cook cleanse natural so usually i'm either dressing or applying oil on other parts of my body and before if you do that we then make sure you wash your hands yeah do you see mix lotion now, i'm usually so particular about my face i feel like i'm becoming really serious about my face so yeah guys so to spray Oh yeah, this is usually a uh, part of the process. So here this one, I'm going to let it dry out. Uh in the meantime, what am I going to be doing? Taking photos of the product for products for Instagram. Yeah, ikikauka cuz na taking you kidogo time. Yeah, so at least now you know. Oh and also guy, I forgot to say that uh the toner has antibacterial properties. So yeah, that's where the prevention from all these pollutants comes in and then you have to mix this with bentonite clay for your acne treatment you see guys you got this you can do this so watch an ngoje ikauke nik take photos see you in a few
so happy with my skin man i feel like to make positive progress yep what color is the sky have you watched coco such a good movie i'm waiting for the rose water to kauka and then yep oh yo is it dark spots that is station eventually three weeks and i'm loving it loving it in the hormonal you know you know what color is the sky and your mood i've taken photos for you all for my insta yeah so the rose water has dried up next is this sunscreen this is another step i've incorporated which i saw a review by another girl uh qua shed naturals page oh but they have not even plugged the um so what the manufacturers of these products wa well, shed naturals i'll link the ninis in the description box all these products and see jolly you'll go and check them out yeah mm. i saw another babe on their page talking about how she wishes she did included um sunscreen in her routine i feel like sunscreen is so good <sighs> disclaimer please 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 avoid contact <laughs> with the eyes like nawaambia kwa kuwa nimekuwa hapo kumbuke ya kuwa sisikia langu unjika ngu i'm telling you out of experience please do not this one na your eyes also this one na your eyes tricks this one na your eyes imagine that has to just get any effect because you know i spray it sometimes my I, then i open my eyes immediately but like there's no effect it's friendly to the eyes but this two comes out this one gosh you guys but now the importance of sunscreen is it promotes uh, it prevents sunburns it just generally gives you prevention from the sun hmm? also niliona it actually apa my research was here <laughs> that it prevents skin cancer and you all know how cancer is very rampant these days well so if you can is do so yeah yeah sunscreen there was another property was it anti aging yeah and early skin aging caused by the sun apparently skin aging as uh, the sun ages you who would have thought and i love the sun i'm walking on sunshine oh and don't feel good um as you've seen i was listening to music while i was working making goja the mask to kauka so guys uh oh yeah i saw on another blog i i do a lot of skincare research like niko serious niko serious apparently sunscreen you're supposed to you're not supposed to mix your sunscreen with your moisturizer i'm about to introduce my moisturizer are you ready chandi fiction chandi play dramatic tin 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 yeah like you're not supposed to mix it that's why i'm buying time you're supposed to let it sit apparently for like a minute or so you ingia kwa skin you absorb your another skin and then finally the last step of the three steps please note that masking na sunscreen ni additional steps people usually preach moisturizing tone toning and uh, cleansing but like sunscreen if you can mask and sunscreen find what works for you yeah but like that babe was talking about how she feels like as in ulikuwa naona the passion in her eyes when she was talking about how she feels like she'd have not skipped sunscreen in her routine so if you can to join so last oh i've not unveiled the moisturizer pin 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 eh the sun though Can you see my focus? Hey. Ladies and gentlemen, jojoba oil. 
it's not jojoba it's jojoba oil so let me be dramatic let me be dramatic this is the last step my loves um moisturizing it's important to moisturize because it hydrates the skin and prevents dryness if your skin is dry it increases damage even if you're oily by the way even if your skin is oily please moisturize don't forget to moisturize it's so important and also so you know the skin loses ability to retain moisture i came with facts baby i came with facts so you need to hydrate it i use all oh, the importance of jojoba oil is because it's waxy so in a sealing the moisture more which prevents dryness because hey who wants to walk around with dry skin girl imagine just damaging intentionally damaging your skin so yeah ladies and gentlemen i assume you gentlemen also take care of your skin it's important i'd love to meet someone who takes care of their skin go to kifanya my mask pamoja charcoal mask or just talking about skin care i shall leave you with the peace of the lord oh wait wait this one this is vitamin e oil vitamin e helps with dark spots um it's my nighttime moisturizer so at night what i usually do oh yeah by the way this is my daytime routine I've masked. Masked is my um, weekly routine. All the steps I've done later after masking. That's my daytime routine. Like in the morning when I wake up. Then there's a nighttime routine. Hey, skincare. There's also a lot of work. And when I was hating, low-key hating on, I was not hating on me makeup. I was just saying how I feel like to me it's too much work. That's not hating because I love, I actually love seeing people do their face beats. But for me, I feel like I needed to work on my base first. Yeah. So at night, what I usually do, I cleanse. Cleanse. <sighs> By the way, I've turned on my notifications for Beauty Bar just in case they restock that other cleanser. But I feel everyone talks, I've read so many reviews about the other one like good reviews Daniel ni a lot of not so good reviews but like it's working for me sijakwana any problems whatsoever it's really good if you want to buy this one naivas is where it's at yeah mm, so i cleanse at night then i tone yeah and then with warm water by the way not hot because hot wine alter the ph um and then this is usually my last step before i go to bed <laughs> vitamin e oil so what i usually do at night is i don't uh do the routine before bed because you're going to sleep so your pillow and your face will interact heavily guess who's going to get more oil not your face sis not your face it's a pillow so what i usually do is like when i get home from work like up or seven or even when i'm just because now we're working we have weekly shifts so like at seven i have alarms for my routine because sometimes oh i just forget or be lazy so you need a reminder so yeah that's another skincare routine hack i feel everyone needs oh, my research book um set alarms imagine there's no shame in setting an alarm ya kukumbusha something so vital i stopped shaming myself i was like unaweza unaweza and i'm like eh i'm human i'm human so what i need to set an alarm for i feel like ni masks cuz i i'm not consistent in masking yeah but this week ni mekwa consistent and like i saw my friend do do her bentonite clay routine and that's when I kumbuka oh I have been to night clay. Mm. Mm. Thank you for listening to my chit chat, acne chit chat of my journey. 
yeah and i hope that when you start i wish you luck and i hope that you find products that work for you me nasikia kama ni nimepata what works for me um i'll save up for sure to get like i want to give this products 3 months a review after 3 months nione alitoka tumefika and then i can start introducing the other things like serums serum like snail serum by the way here i've also read very good reviews about it so 3 months see you in 3 months yeah for skin not for content am i just in case i get something interesting along the way i'll share it Ah yeah, kwa hivi ni na mwena juma pili njema. Santini sana kwa ku watch my content. Uh, I know this video will be hella long, but ni life, my brother.